Hello Wolfpack, we're back here with another Wolves of Crypto Trader today. Today we're going to be looking at VeChain. Now VeChain is on a descending wedge formation on a longer term support zone that is held throughout the entirety of 2021, starting around February there. And so given the fact we're on this descending wedge formation, which is typically a bullish structure, and then the fact we're on this support formation as well, the chances of an upside break look pretty likely here on VeChain. We can also look at something like the volume to determine what the trend is, and the trend right now is downwards, but what we can see is that there's a very clear sign of potential trend reversal here on VeChain, is that every time we see green candles in a small upwards trend, like we saw here about a couple of weeks ago there, we see ascending volume, and every time we see red candles in a small downwards trend, like we've seen in the last week or so, we see descending volume. This means that every time there is a small rally, more and more people are willing to buy into VeChain, and every time there is a small sell-off, less and less people are willing to sell VeChain, which kind of suggests that, hey, we're coming towards the the end of the downwards momentum here at least for the short term applying fibonacci retracement we can get an idea of where this bounce would go to if we see it and if we do break above this wedge formation and it isn't if we need to actually close above it before entering this trade so bringing up the bull market support band in kind of uh, conjunction with this Fibonacci retracement, we can kind of expect VeChain, if we are going to see a bounce, to bounce to around the 8.5 cent region and that is where the take profit will be now, as for a stop loss, it's a little bit more debatable as to where you want to put it. Personally, you'd probably be looking at, well, I'd probably be looking at a region around $0.05 because that's where most of the daily candle closes have been, but I'd be waiting for a daily close below $0.05 cents before I actually take profits. If you wanted to set an automatic take profit, you're in, going into a little bit of a risky territory here on VeChain, and this is definitely a trade you want to actually keep an eye on personally rather than relying on a take profit, as the region that we would be holding for support on a, on a kind of a technical basis is all the way down here at around 30 to 27 percent lower so you really want to be manually uh, managing this trade and you really want some time aside to look over this trade as it happens so remember don't get into this trade unless we actually break above the wedge and if we do we can start talking about uh, those take profit zones like i just talked about there about uh, a minute ago so thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed uh, and this is a trading idea not a signal i'll catch you in the next one